Hi viewers, uh, this is a presentation from interview.com. I'm going to talk about what are the advantages of object-oriented programming languages. Okay, very important question. If you are a senior developer, Java developer, then you should know in detail to answer this question. What are the advantages of object-oriented programming language? Okay, the object-oriented programming language directly directly represent the real life objects like employee, account, car, jeep, customer, etc. The features of object-oriented programming languages like polymorphism, inheritance, encapsulation make it powerful. The first statement says that you can create the real life objects. For example, if you are in a financial domain, if you want to develop a software in financial domain, you can represent account as a class you can create a, you can create an object of accounts you can create a class of credit debit and uh, loan such real life objects you can create okay this is one of the advantage and other other features like polymorphism inheritance and encap encapsulation it's a very big topic polymorphism inheritance and encapsulation now it is becoming very po popular in software industry it's a very big topic in here i'll be explaining a little bit about that okay so how does the object oriented programming approach improve the software development the key benefits are reuse of previous framework i have already implemented before one year i want to reuse it so you can reuse it using implementation inheritance means code inheritance you can extend the class and you can reuse the method you don't have to write your new class or new code just you you, you can extend and use it object composition you just make a pointer or you just may make a uh, reference in your class and you can just um, delegate delegate your a uh, delegate your call to that already uh, the implemented methods okay implemented class or implemented object object composition okay so real mapping to the problem domain objects can be mapped to the real world objects okay uh, okay these are the benefits key benefits you should be aware at least these three keywords polymorphism inheritance and encapsulation you should be aware of okay i'll be talking about reuse of code and polymorphism in this slide i have written a class migration and class export and class import okay okay um, class export extends migration class import extends migration okay here you can see they have their own implementation they have their own implementation plus they are using the copy file method from the base class here i have missed out extends you have to place the extends here so class import extends migration class 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 import extends migration class class export extends migration class so we are reusing the copy file methods so i mean i have given just an example like this you can have a lot of reusage okay this is one of the uh, advantage I would say inheritance okay polymorphism polymorphism is like at runtime you can switch your implementation for example I have an interface here parser and XML parser implements parser and text parser implements parser and they are they both are implementing parse method okay so in this case at runtime these two class we can we can inject the implementation of XML parser or the text parser based on the user input and the scenario okay so this is polymorphism polymorphism is very powerful at runtime i want to inject the different implementations okay hope you understood the advantages of object oriented programming language um it's a very big topic but i've given only the, the the gist the essentials okay for more java interview questions log on to interview.com india's top interview guide you can find a lot of inter uh, java interview questions in my site okay thanks for watching our video all the best for your interview thank you